What? Shut up! No! Ah, welcome to my crib! Clearly not my house, it looks too nice. This is actually at Sofitel Sentosa and this is the... Uh, what is this called? Imperial Suite, the second largest room in Sofitel Sentosa. I have guests! Where, where did you guys come from? Uh, it's called what oh, a surprise indeed. What a surprise. It is going to be a Chinese New Year episode. Hope you guys like bakwa. There's gonna be a lot. Let's go eat the bakwa in one of the rooms. You can get lost in this. There's so many rooms. So many rooms, place. right? Okay, but we're gonna pick one and we're gonna eat bakwa. Silence on set! <laughs> so we're gonna be fancy. I'm gonna use fork. Have you ever eaten bakwa with fork and spoon? No, I no. Sure. But we're in a fancy hotel. Yes. Mine was all char. There's a lot more char than mm, I love was. the char part. However, I'm not sure if I'm down with eating this bakwa with pork. My bakwa has to have char. I have a suspicion it will taste better. With your hands. Mm -hmm. With the hands. <sighs> yeah, it tastes better. It feels more natural to eat with the hands, right? Yeah, definitely. I don't think it changes the flavor. It's just the, the feel like your sweat uh, then it makes it salty. Stop right there. Do you know sandwiches taste better when they're in triangles? What? Right? No, 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 no. Yeah, there's no, that doesn't change no, the fact. No, no. 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 Look Fake it up, fact. look it up. There is another set of bakwa, but this is sliced bakwa. What do you mean sliced bakwa? Isn't I it thought bakwa is already sliced. <laughs> yeah. Traditional bakwa is made with minced pork, so it's not sliced. Oh, so this is like a whole slice from yeah. like the pork itself oh. rather than minced. Ah. Feel this actually tastes moister than moisture. Yes. And this one. Uh, yes. You think it's also softer? Yes. This might be because of the vacuum seal. Yeah, I feel like it, it's, yeah. it's like held all the, mm -hmm. know, the juices. Or doesn't like dry out. Because it doesn't dry out as much. Yeah. Oh, did they really? both come back in? They both came back in seal? <laughs> wow. <laughs> that was that earlier, damn it. Still, it's softer. It's softer. Weirdly, you would think because it's less fat, it should actually be tougher, but it's not. That's quite surprising. I don't get as much char in this one though. I would want mine to have a lot of char. Which I'll be fair. I really like the char on the, yep. the other one, but the texture on this one is better. I like this one? This one? Yeah, I like, I like the sliced one better. For me, I think I like the mince one. Okay. I think the char helped a bit. Yeah, I'll go yeah. with the char. Yeah. I don't mind that it's a bit harder, it's yeah. a bit chewier, okay. like jerky. I like quite jerky. like the... Oh. Jerky. So we're gonna give how many pineapples out of five today? Four pineapples. Four out pineapples. Of five. I give it four point five actually. The the cha is not common. You know, Ping Zhuan does it really well. Yeah. I think four point five for me as well. Four point five. Cause for the thickness, I think it's quite soft. For me, the mouth feel feels very different. It's minced, right? So there's more texture when you bite. But most bakwa is minced. Like normally bakwa. This, this just feels <laughs> different from the normal bakwa that I actually. Ah okay. So now we're going <coughs> to like unique flavors. Unique flavors. Right? Unique okay. flavors. Yeah, individual packaging. Why does it smell so familiar? It smells like bakwa. It smells like fog! Family. It smells like a zizha dish. I don't know why. Okay, my tongue is on fire. Hey, fuck lah. This is mala, right? Is it mala? Oh god, it's spicy. It reminds me of like a sambal kangkong. Mmm. It's like chili oil. Maybe quite interesting. Could it be sambal? I don't feel it's sambal. I feel chili? it's just like chili putty. Mm. Mm. I don't find it too spicy. Yeah. It's got a good spice to it. It's okay. Like you can see some like chili uh, seeds. I really like this one. Because yeah. I, li I like I like right. spicy food in same general. Here, same here. Ah, I've never had a spicy bakwan, so this is new. Uh, chili. Uh, chili. Uh, I would spicy, say it's, like it's spicy. Chili, bakwan. Yeah. Spicy chili bakwan. Chili bakwan. Spicy bakwan. Oh, sambal bakwan. Chili bakwan. My palate's not bad. <laughs> For me, I'll give it 4.5. My usual bakwan is just normal, traditional, safe. Mm. But so it's like spice okay. with a kick. It makes you want to eat more. I go with 4 by 5 though. Well. Like I would say this is closer to 5 for me. Okay. I would like it to be a little bit more, more right, spicy. Right, right. Definitely 4 yep. by 5 to 5. For families who love spicy food yep. in yeah. general, yeah. this is going to be like quite a hit. It's not just spicy too. It's got the bakwa flavor, yeah. but then the back end of that spice. Huh? Like it's yeah. not going to be like... Uh... Okay, cool. Next. Okay, so this is also from King Tea. Uh, DIY. Is this like the thing, like those instant noodles, you just add the water oh, yeah, yeah, and yeah. it self-heats? You add water to the self-heating. That's but cool. Because steam makes it softer. It could be a little bit of a gimmick, yeah. but mm. it's an interesting gimmick. Do not use boiling water. Mm. Bakwa. 
What, am I like the only what? one that I feel like a barbarian? Yeah, like, how, how are you so adept at this? Can, can see? Then I think that's enough. Bakwa back. I'm gonna put a lid and hopefully it steams. It doesn't steam, steam for me. Damn, it's good. <laughs> okay, we have a third flavor from uh, Oso Kenti. This is the one I, you know, sometimes my friends have at the house. This is the one I eat. It smells like char siu. Family. It's very thin though, this one. There's a bit, I of, think, I there's think a bit of spice, spicy. right? I think it's still, it's still spicy. It's sweet and spicy. What is sweet and spicy? Thai chili. Is it honey chili? I'm gonna okay. guess it's sweet and spicy. I'm sweet and spicy. <laughs> I'm, gonna, I'm gonna go with um, spicy honey. Chili honey, chili honey, okay. It's fine. Chili I'm going with chili honey. My first impression of the spakwa tasted to me like nonya dumplings. Nonya dumplings? Sweet nonya. Oh, like the nonya dumpling with a very unique guess. No. Mala. 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 No. no. Too sweet to be mala. Yeah, if you I didn't could... tell me this is mala, I would never know. Doesn't it doesn't have that, have that numb. That numb. Yeah, that yeah, numb. Yeah. Yeah. I'll give it a treat. It doesn't really taste like a mala, but it's not too bad. The yeah. flavor itself. The flavor is yeah, nice. as the flavor itself is but nice. But I was associated yeah. with yeah, yeah, mala. Yeah, yeah. yeah I, I go for three as well. It's a bit too far off from mala. I'm, I'm a three. I'm a three. I'm a three. Yeah, I'm a three. three. As a regular bakwan, just flavor wise, right. it's like a solid four. Yeah. But as a mala bakwan, it's like I think it's got areas to improve with the mala flavor. Yeah. 15 minutes later. <laughs> <laughs> no so, steam. We screwed it up, guys. Cheers. Yes. Mm -hmm. It's kind of warm. It's very sweet. I like the whole steaming thing. I thought the anticipation was more yeah. was a lot more fun. Do you feel like if it was really nice and warm, it would have it would that, enhance that. Yeah, it would have um, enhanced the whole feel. Like even though the, the bakwan is just yeah, sweet. It's it's a good bakwan, but like a freshly steamed mm. hot bakwan. Mm. I guess 3.5. <laughs> for me, I'll give yeah, just a treat. So it didn't impress you as much. Pretty normal for me. I think just the whole DIY thing for me, I I'll be a 3.5 as well. It's quite cute. Move on. To the next BK. Fire. Fire. Spelt in the exact same way yes. the giant scandal. <laughs> this one is thick. Ooh. Oh. Yeah, yo, bacon. Family. This one. No, okay, no, wait. This oh, one's normal no. like mala. No, no, mala. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This okay. one has the mala, the mala, the mala, the mala pot. Okay, the spice is slowly growing on my tongue. Okay, now it's coming. The numb is coming. This is 100% mala. mala. Wow, shao. The numbing is there. You know that um, peppery, florally taste yeah, that mala good. gives? It's very aromatic. Yeah, that yeah, aromatic. Yeah. This is so good. I like it's not super spicy. Well. This, this is mala is xiao la. Xiao la? Yeah, this is xiao la. <laughs> What's xiao la? The least spicy Least spicy. Mm. Mm. It's very authentic. What else is different? What else is different? So besides mala, there's something else? It's thick. Like, really thick. The way this smoky is. There's more something in it. Tea. Apple wood. I don't get as much of the charm. My tongue is too numb to taste anything now. I actually think tea could yeah. be a pretty good guess. Tea? I'm gonna guess apple wood, like just the wood. Like I'll guess a little bit of Earl Grey tea. Earl Grey tea, okay. Earl Grey tea for Gary. <laughs> I'll just say tea also. Tea? Okay. <laughs> what? What? Ah, what? Fucking what? apple wood, bro. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> You didn't know that. Yeah! Anyhow, uh, apple wood. <laughs> this, for me, the mala precedes everything. It's too strong. It takes over the smoky flavor. Lucky <laughs> guess, right? You don't see my confidence. Please it's rewind crazy. when he said the apple wood the first time. I guarantee it was more like apple wood? Apple wood. This reminds me a lot of ham. Is this smoked like, like apple, smoke apple wood ham. also? It's like smoked ham. ham. I don't know what wood, but like the, the smokiness is definitely a lot more unique. Because earlier on, the mala took over everything, but this one I can yeah. really smell the taste, the smoke, and smell the smoke. Mm. They're original. It's not the traditional Asian Chinese bakwa. It's a it bit more amoyish. Ah, amoyish, yeah. This like a smoked ham. Man. Family. The texture is all bakwa, but the flavor is a bit more like gammon ham mm. or yeah, like yeah, yeah. some sort of smoked ham. I would prefer a bit more sweetness just to like balance out the smokiness. Oh, the smokiness is actually very you can even eat this on Christmas. <laughs> this is a new year. Oh my god. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You can bring Bakwa to Christmas party. I'll give it still like a solid 4.5. 4.5? 4.5. Same. I'll give it a 4 actually. Are you not a savory person? I, I am a savory. This confuses my... But you just said you want it to be more sweet. Yeah, that's why I think that would be more similar to Bakwa. I don't know. I don't know why I want to He's, like he's a very Asian person. <laughs> yeah. But generally, I think as a, as a brand, this fire brand, yeah. they're like... They like, really know their stuff. They're yeah. doing really well. It's still like, definitely like above average. It's still a yeah. 4 for me. It's the mala is just... Uh, the mala flavor one. Okay, that's flavor. From fire as well? Yeah, it's from fire. What? Oh. Whoa! Whoa, whoa, whoa. Why is this so... This, this is, really is so oily. oily. It's not oily, huh? Is there a flavor okay, to this? Okay. It's a very mild flavor if there is. Okay, no... I might guess. I might guess. But I don't want to tell you. 
It has a lot of eyes. It has a lot of eyes. Okay, I know it. Okay, I go somewhere and look for this. Okay, okay, I'm all there. It does taste very tender though. Does it taste tender? You can taste tender. <laughs> this one confuses me. One, two, one. Pineapple. Vinegar. Is it pineapple? Is it all right? Pineapple? Oh yeah, pineapple. Yo! How many pineapples for this pineapple? I give this a three. Three? Point yeah. five. No, three. Three? I actually like this over the original. I would give this four point five. Like this, this what? has that sweetness that I was talking about. Like it's a bit sweeter, and that's all I need. Not as smoky though, but I like this. For me, I'll give it three point five. Yeah, you're just bitter because yeah. you cannot guess what flavor it is. Yeah, <laughs> fragrance, maqua. It's in a coin. Three flavors. That's good for fun sure. It's easy that's, to eat as well. Isn't maqua. that the whole point of the the coin? Is there a flavor to it? I don't know why, but it tastes kind of plastic. <laughs> it tastes like normal maqua on me. It's got a it's like a pork. smoky ish. Aftertaste. Texture is a bit harder. Not the sweet, sweet bakwa. Faintly sweet, yeah. Faintly yeah. sweet. Mm. But flavor wise, yeah. I can't think of anything. No. It's tender though. You thought it was tender? No, I think the soft previous one was tender. So, what flavor is this? It's a Spanish Iberico. All I can taste is pork. Generally, I don't know the big thing with Iberico pork. I couldn't distinguish the Iberico pork on yeah. here. It's not a bad bakwa, it's a good bakwa still. Is it that different from a normal bakwa? Probably more expensive as well. That's the thing. Like, if you're gonna pay Probably an extra premium for this, like, <laughs> yeah. I don't know if. Yeah, uh, is it worth the premium, right? Right. Yeah. So maybe a three for me. I'll give it a 3.5. Probably. I give it a three. I couldn't really tell it's Iberico. Yeah. Oh. Very average. Probably yeah. more expensive, but okay. 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 Move on. Oh, freaking this is pretty obvious. Yeah, uh, this one's obvious. This one is one of those ones you can smell it. One, two, three. Black truffle. truffle. That's nice though. It's not the artificial truffle flavor. This one tastes pretty real. Okay. But for meat wise, I think this is better than the Iberico. Give it a four? I'll give it four as well. Ah. I guess four, okay, peer pressure. I'm gonna, yeah, four, four. I'm a four. Yeah, you think sweet, eh? It doesn't taste like normal bakwa. This is a lighter bakwa. I have a feeling this this one might not be pork. This would be a halal bakwa. Don't tell me this is plant based bakwa. Plant based? Oh, I would sure. be. No, no, right? I would be shocked no. if this <laughs> was plant based. Yeah. I'm gonna have chicken. I feel it's chicken. Chicken, chicken bakwa. Four word genius. What is this? Crocodile meat. Crocodile Shut up! No! What? That was shocking! Crocodile bakwa. What the f? What? They do crocodile bagua. Oh, I finally bagua. eaten crocodile. I've yeah, never eaten crocodile in my life. I think that's really interesting. They do say crocodile does supposedly taste a bit like chicken. This tastes better than the Iberico pork. <laughs> crocodile bagua? This is pretty good. Oh, you rate this? Flavor? Like 3.5? I thought it was like okay, but then I, I discovered it's crocodile no, like, yeah, and all crocodile. of a sudden it's 4.5. Like shock, just shock factor. <laughs> shock factor. Like shock factor. Yeah, I think I'll give it 4.5 also. Because it's light enough that you can eat a lot. Mm. You, you won't get yeah. sick of it after a while. I would give it a 4.5 just like because it's such a conversation. Starter. It tastes decent, but then when you tell your uncle and auntie, oh, this is actually crocodile, they'll be like, okay, I don't need to know whether you get married or not. Let's just talk about this. Hey, when when you when you're having a kid, try the crocodile bath. Oh, okay. Not married yet, no girlfriend. Get the crocodile. Bath. <laughs> get the crocodile. All right, let's move on. Golden gourmet. Golden. Golden. I actually have not heard of this brand before. To be fair, I haven't heard of, heard of any of these brands. I know that. Like, You've been here for a while now. What the <laughs> hell? This is different. Oh, different yeah, meat again, okay. It has some added benefits. Added, added benefits. benefits. Is that fiber in this? It smells a bit herby though. Dry aged meat? Mm. I feel like it's got that funk to it. Fermented kind of smell. Yeah. It's very tender. The softer so far. Very soft. Yo, there's definitely some kind of herb inside. I'm gonna go with chicken thigh again, this one. Chicken, chicken thigh. thigh. Can I guess frog leg? Eh, shit, I wanna guess frog also. Okay, I know. Oh, too late, too late. Get... Don't copy me, don't, okay, copy. don't okay, say frog please. No, okay, then turtle. What's the answer? Lacto chicken. Ah! <laughs> What's a lacto chicken? Lacto chicken is basically organic and ethically farm. Golden Gourmet promotes this to have probiotic. Okay, mm. okay. I'm Stand just great. so happy that I'm right. <laughs> It was too obvious an answer. <laughs> it was too boring, right? Yeah, it was too boring, yeah. I would say uh, 4.5. If you have friends that are like a bit eco-friendly, blah, blah, yeah, like yeah. they don't want to eat pork or chicken. Maybe 4. It's very tender, but somehow I'm missing some elements of bakwa inside. Yeah. It's not 100%. Because it's chicken. Yeah, <laughs> maybe I need more char. Okay. If you have more char, I'll give it 4.5. Right. I'll give it a 4. 4 pineapples. Let's move on to the next one from... It's also from Golden Gourmet. Yeah, this one's pork again. Yeah, yeah this is smell spicy. Is it mala again? How many mala have you been there? It's definitely spicy. It's a spice to it. It's not very heavy spice. The chili is creeping up now. I don't think it's mala. Is it chili again? It's a lot more kick than the first chili one though. Chili party? What if it's a western chili? Oh yeah. No, it's like the green chili. No, no way. Obvious guess. Sambal chili. Do we have to guess a type of chili? I feel like I it's just it's chili. Obvi is it just chili? Okay, normal chili for Gary. Okay, I'll, I'll be different a bit. I'll go to ghost pepper. Ghost, ghost pepper? pepper. Okay, chili party. Okay, sorry. Jalapeno. What is it? 
Chili Padi. Mince the chili with the Oh, they oh. mince the chili party into the bakwan. Which do you prefer though? Previous chili bakwan or this one? Oh, Which do yeah, you prefer? I like the taste of this one. The last one I said it could be a little bit more spicy, spicy right? More spicy. So this is a little bit more spicy. But the other one is thicker. Well, I'll, I'll give this one like uh, four. I mean, five balls. Yeah, I think. Yeah, four. Four? It's soft enough for both Okay. Four. Four. I go with four. I still prefer the, the other one though. Is this the last one? Oh, yes. So we can. Wrap That's this up it for the bakwa. We can wrap this up. Get it? <laughs> Stop here wrapping this. Anyway, so we've come to the end of tasting. What do you guys think? That one for sure is the fire mala. I think that was the only one I ranked. Gave a five as well. To me, that one was just. Yeah. I think we all gave a five for that. And also okay. the fragrance crocodile. One. Okay. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Interesting Look choice. Like Interesting yeah. choice. I like the truffle one actually. Like I think fire did it really well. It's not just like truffle oil. Oh, mm. Sorry. It's fragrance. It's fragrance. Oh, sorry. It's that's fragrance. fragrance. No, it's fragrance. Oh, fragrance with truffle. Oh shit. I think the most yeah. char flavor one was the very the first, very first, the very first one. one. All the other ones, I would have expected more char flavor, and it turned out that that one had the charest. Yeah, Big one. Big one, one did it one well. Is... Should we go through comments? Ah, oh, god damn it! Go wash hands first. Okay, should we wash hands? Okay, break. Okay, wash break. hands. Okay, break. It's comments time! Okay, let's go to like the one I did with Aaron. I like Aaron's unassuming nature and the insights he brings from his experience as a chef. As this is his first time, he may be a little self-conscious, but I'm sure he'll become a very good food reviewer. Great job. Oh, thank you. Wow. Yeah, super nervous at first time. I like that we got different guest hosts. Aaron is good and for his first time too. Ha ha. Actually, I quite like Erica, who was our previous host. Joy, Jen, and Gary as your host. They blend well with Seth. It makes it more interesting. Aaron is knowledgeable on his taste on food, but very straight and a bit serious. <laughs> Maybe shy? I think audience. I'm less serious today. Editor dishing out quality edits as always. Keep it up. Like, kudos to Alice, who is in Singapore. <laughs> <laughs> that was like only your <laughs> eye. Like Middle Eastern music was played in the Thai restaurant segment. Uh, <laughs> back to Alice again. Alice. What was what do you mean, what's Thai music? It was... Yeah, 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 yeah. That is culturally insensitive. But culturally true. My wife is Thai. She's at home like listening to like yeah. the Thai music. It is that. I like Gary on the show. I like you, AC. So that's the end of the comments. Do remember to like and subscribe to our channel. I hope you enjoyed the two hosts with us. Happy Chinese New Year, everyone. Happy 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 New Year, everyone. Got the rabbit reference, but okay, bye bye. bye, bye. You get bye. it. Bye. Yeah, I like okay. it. Bye bye. Bye bye. bye, bye. bye, bye. <laughs> 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 what? What can I open? Okay, let me try it again. One, two, three. Oh, welcome to my crib. <laughs>